Hey, what's up, everybody? Thank you for checking me out. My name is Eko Simpson. I'm a Ghanaian um, and I live in Ghana. Well, you are watching this channel because somebody introduced you to it. It was recommended or suggested to you on YouTube. Yes. Hey, what's good, everybody? Thank you for checking me out. This is Echo Sims. It's a beautiful day here in a rural community called Asumji Community. In our language, Asumji means peace. Yeah, so this is a peaceful community. So shout outs to my friend, uh, Michael Olins. He's the CEO of Touchlight Tours. So today he called me and said, Hey, Echo, I'm bringing these wonderful people from the U.S. Uh, they have constructed a beautiful borehole for the good people of Asomji because for the past years they've been living here, you know, they fetch water from the ground, which is not really healthy. So he spoke to, I think, the leader of the group that are here in Ghana. So Touchlight Tours is basically a, a tour company. So they bring people from all over the world to Ghana. So I think they had a conversation and Makita, uh, who is one of the tourists who came, said, hey, I want to do something beautiful for the people of Asomji. So before they got to Ghana, she has already constructed this beautiful borehole where the good people of this community is going to have a good drinking water. Some of you happen to be somewhere in the West where things are a little bit okay for you. And if you want to see Africa grow, then this is the time for us to do things together because the government wouldn't even come and do this, no. So it is your responsibility, my responsibility to lace together and then come and do some of these things for the, you know, for most of the communities that are lacking either water, electricity, um, clinic and all that. So we came here today, Asomji community, to show what Makita and then the husband and the friends did for the beautiful people of Asomji community. So let's go there and let me show you exactly what happened here. <laughs> Tangan Kwame uh, from Chicago. Uh, it's a pleasure to be here. Thank you for welcoming, welcoming me and my friends to the village. Uh, this is my second time in Ghana, and I'm looking forward to staying connected with you. Thank you. I'm Claudia Cunningham. I'm very, very happy to be here to experience this culture, and I feel the love. I feel my ancestors. I'm happy, happy to be here. Yeah. I am Lucas Payne. We come from the United States. We are very grateful for your welcoming us. Thank you. Good morning, family. Thank you so much for your welcome. My name is Marquita Payne, and I'm very excited to be in your presence. So thank you. Oh, 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 oh. Thank you so 
much for welcoming us and showing us so much love. And we love you guys too. And we just want to say thank you. Never traditional gathering where we gather like this. There's a need to first and foremost invite our ancestors, yes. and we said that by saying a prayer, and a prayer is in the form of libation. You would have you a head. Then we pray a man and the unnam, the letter, and then the important. We're able to have. Yet, I want to be to travel all the way to come to this village. They have never seen a thing like this before. They are overwhelmed. Very happy that you are here to share your love with them. And also they said that for what you have done for them, they are going to give you more stability in this village. I'm talking about my sister Makita. They are going to make you a development queen of this village so that you'll be feel more part and parcel of the continual development that they envision will come to this village by first and foremost building this bubble for them. So they are very honored, they are very happy, they say they love you so much and they thank you for everything. And today they are going to give you that title on you and um, what they meant is whatever you are doing, whatever your endeavors, may it be great. And today will be a short ceremony. You go, you prepare, you come back for a bigger coronation. You go and bring families and friends so that they can come and see the good work you have started with. That is what the community is saying. And that was a prayer you said. same way you do and we believe too much is given much is also required God has given us resources so that he can bring us back to this village to give to each of you it's something really small and our plan is to bring our three-year-old son back so that he can commune with you and be one with you so again thank you so much for this opportunity I love you. I'm appreciative of the time that we have to share with you. So thank you so much.
All right, so the village said they are very happy. They thank you so much. As I gave you earlier, you know, glimpses that they want to honor you. They want to make you the development chief, the development queen mother of this community, so that you feel more part and parcel of the continual development of the community. They don't have much, but at least they have this token that they want to give you as a sign of stability and also anytime you see, you see this too, you remember you have a village in Ghana and the village is Asundre community. Father Lord, we thank you in the name of the Lord Jesus. We thank you for a day like this. We thank you for the blessing that you have released upon this community. We thank you for the people that have come to do this for us, O oh Lord. I pray and I declare this commission in the name of the Lord Jesus. In the name of the Father, of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. So for me, it's a very great initiative. I'm very happy that you thought about our women and the young girls who are coming up. And I believe this will gradually boost even their confidence. Yes. It will boost their confidence because they will feel more fulfilled, more happy. Because on that 
period of the month, they become very disturbed. They don't know what they are even going to use to make themselves clean and feel more hygienic. So for me, this should be an initiative, an ongoing initiative that any time that there's an opportunity, let us try to bring more of these nice things. Hi, I'm Lucas Payne. This is my wife, Marquita Payne, and Mr. Michael Orleans uh, of Torchlight Tours. Um, prior to planning our first trip together um, to Ghana, um, my wife had it in her heart to do a project here um, to, to leave something meaningful or sustainable. Uh, so we decided on a borehole, and um, Thanks to Michael, he was able to coordinate with local people here to find where the need was. We believe to much is given, much is also required. In the name of God, we dedicate this well to the people of this village. Um, we are so grateful to be here today with our family. Our ancestors have brought us back here and we are um, just really excited to be able to be connected again with our family. Well, I think that the, the message is clear. We are African wherever we are. We are African in America. We are African in Australia. We are African in the Middle East. We are African in China. We are African in Great Britain. So we, need, we all need to come back to know our roots, to connect with the diaspora all around the world. And it's time for us to that have been privileged to go to the West, we were able to uh, do so much that we could uh, and, and have a good life, that it's time for us to pour back into this continent that's been exploited for a thousand years or more, you know, between all the different people that have come here. Black people unite around the world so we can come together with our financial resources, with our talents, with our education, and we come back here to this land where we came from to help our people. Great, Oops. great. Yeah, so this is Michael and Lens, Torchlight Toss. I am overwhelmed today. Uh, I don't even know what to say. Um, giving back to the community is a major part of what we do. Having grew up in the streets of Cape Coast and uh, where I am today, the help that I have received from my brothers and sisters in the diaspora always um, have the intention to also give back. So when our brother and sister were coming, they invited family and friends to come with them. One thing which was on their hearts is what they can do meaningfully, sustainably for most privileged community. And of course, we identify as some community and uh, what you see today is a great blessing. Um, the water I saw the first day when I came to the village, as a KTC, every community that you go, they will serve you with water to welcome you. My heart was broken when I saw the water these people are drinking. It was very sad, but I'm very happy that today, to our brother and sister, we have been able to put together a well they have dedicated to their son, and we believe that this will speak a lot into the life of the son. Every day that they pour water, they are pouring blessings into the son, and we believe that he will grow and even do greater than what the parent did. So thank you so much, my brother and my sister. If any brother or sister want to connect with Torchlight Toss, if you want to come and visit and have the best of experience, connect with Torchlight Tours. Thank you so much. All right, so thank you very much for checking out. Did you see what happened? Our sister was installed as the queen mother of Asumji. You know, let me tell you something. We Africans love and accept people who are hardworking, who are ever ready to see the development of each other. So when you come to Ghana, depending on where you find yourself, some of these things may happen to you because for some time now, look at them. Um, we could see some of the men, you know, as old as 60 years, and we can tell that there has not been good drinking water for that so many years. So if Makita and the husband 
and the friends are doing this. Definitely the only thing that the community can, they don't have money. If they have money, they would have built this thing already. So, I mean, the bit they could do was to say, hey, Makita, you've done well. Uh, we want to instill you, give you the position as the queen mother of Asumji. This is a, just a little community. So Makita, you have a lot to do. Um, congratulations on your coronation. I heard there's going to be the bigger one, but congratulations on, you know, you being the queen mother of Asumji. And keep doing what you're doing. God bless you. And thank you very much for checking out my videos. If this is your first time, like I said, kindly subscribe. A consensus mm -hmm. connecting Africans in the diaspora to the oh, mountain. <laughs> 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 <laughs>